Hey guys, and welcome back to the Elder Scrolls Morrowind. I'm sorry it's been a little bit since we've gotten on Morrowind. It's been a very, very stressful last few weeks for me, especially because I'm walking so slow. That's not why. <laughs> I feel threatened. All right. But I have been working 7.30 to 5 every single day. Not every single day, but most days. I'm kind of tired. Actually, scratch that. I'm really tired. And today we're going to be doing a really hard quest. <laughs> so, what a great way to relax. But yeah, I have a temporary job right now. It's just going to be for the rest of June and maybe the beginning of July. I've been talking about it on my Twitter and Instagram, so I probably won't talk about it that much on here, but I forgot where I was going. I'm so tired. But yeah, I just, I really wanted to put an episode out because for one, it had been a while and for another, I don't know how often I'm going to be uploading this month, but after this month, let me just head towards Narmok. I want to say that's up this way, but I can't remember. <laughs> uh. But yeah, um, what was I even saying? Oh man, help. <laughs> yeah, after... I'm done with this temporary job. I am going to have a capture card so I can be live streaming more. I want to live stream things like, I've been wanting to play Dragon Age for a while. I've played a little bit of Origins. I have all of them. That's definitely one of them I want to do. And there's a bunch of other games I want to do too. I have them all written down and some things with Ryder. And I think I've also figured out why Skyrim wasn't wanting to record on my boyfriend's computer. And even if for some reason it won't work on the computer, I should be able to record it with the capture card. If I'd rather play it on the computer though, just because I like the mods better. Where am I going? I'm not going the right way. <laughs> guys, I'm just so dead, but I really wanted to play Morrowind for you guys. I've missed this. <sighs> Y'all are just going to have to bear with me. <laughs> this is not going to be a fun day for little Teldra, nor me. I'm probably not going to try to talk too much during the road trip there, because... I know what's going to happen, and I know we're going to need a little bit of time to do our assigned quest, so yeah. I just wanted to explain real quick why I might not be uploading very much this month and why I probably look and am acting like a huge mess. At least I think Narmok is like... Oh man, I feel... I, I don't even know where I'm going. I'm just going to wander around for a while, you guys. Like... I'll find it. I'll find it eventually. Amorank, Aldora. I don't feel like it's either of those ways. <sighs> Let me just. Yeah, it's off towards Caldera. <laughs> I knew it was somewhere up here, but I just, I couldn't remember. <laughs> My brain is too dead to function. So yeah, I guess we are going the wrong way and should turn around. Huh? <sighs> I don't function very well when I'm tired. Not at all. I want to have an ESO episode out fairly soon, and then I have my room tour all filmed and mostly edited. I just wanted to get some gameplay videos in here before I uploaded the room tour, because I feel like I've been doing so many like IRL things, and I prefer doing Let's Plays, so I think I passed my turn again. I'm such a mess. I shouldn't be recording. Okay. I'm going to cut so much of this episode out. Hopefully it won't bother you guys, me wandering around aimlessly. Uh, I feel like this is quite how Teldrin would actually act, like too tired to function most of the time. Sounds like him. I'm just, I'm getting into the role-playing spirit of the Elder Scrolls, okay? Mm, there's cliff racers. I'm gonna let my, my fatigue, I caught myself, almost said stamina. My fatigue, come back. <laughs> I usually like being, it's a spooky noise. I usually like being more peppy when I record. I feel like my good energy is still there because I am in a good mood. I'm just... I'm just... I need to go to bed. That's it. But I'm probably gonna stay up and edit this anyways. I don't know. We'll see. I'm just like too overly dedicated to making YouTube videos, I think, because when I'm not making them, I just feel so confused. Like, what, what am I doing? And then I like start stressing out because I'm like, I haven't made a video in a while. Huh. It's become kind of a weird addiction. <laughs> Do y'all like the Colossus is just like right there now? He's gonna be in most of my videos. I'm so happy. 
Dottie's not in here today, though. Like, she ran out of my room right before I started recording, and I've never felt more betrayed. Like, what is an episode of Morrowind without Dova Kitty? I don't know. Okay, so I just realized we're actually supposed to be kind of heading towards Alderaan, but that's okay, because we're headed there anyways. We need to go r literally right there. Like, we're headed right there. I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of getting back into the hang of it. <laughs> it's taken me a little bit. I'm, like, slouching, too. Like, isn't that great? We'll just, this is going to be a relaxed episode, so I'm just going to angle the webcam down. Though it's not going to be relaxed. I know I'm going to be freaking out in about 15 minutes time. You know, I, I just realized I could have taken a silt strider to Alderaan, you, you know. Might have made things a little bit easier on tired little me. I'm such a mess. Ah! Leave me alone. No. Let's just walk a little bit. Get our fatigue back before we have to fight it. No. No, leave me alone. Oh, I'm jiggling around. This is unpleasant. It can't even get to me. I'm just jiggling. Help. Ah, I don't want to go that way because there's more things to fight. Just try to reach it. Oh, these awful noises. Y you know what? I'm I'm stuck. I'm actually stuck. Look at that. It's it's a miracle. Tel Teldrin can fly. I'm so proud of him. You do it. I'm so proud of this elf boy. Yes. Live your dreams, Teldrin. Live your dreams. <laughs> We're fine. Didn't happen. Teldrin just knows how to fly. It's fine. Don't worry about it. How do I get in this place? It's just a wall. I'm sad. Oh, I thought that was going to be a door and it wasn't. Ah! No! No! Run towards the guards! Ah! Oh no, we're just going to run into a cliff racer if we do that. Why? Oh, we're actually killing it because our weapon's not horribly broken. It's killing us too, though. Uh... Okay, here's the door. No! <laughs> Can't give me now. Yeah, look at this guy! <gasps> yeah, look at him! Cliff racers are huge. I've only just realized. Like, I only have a few like, can we just appreciate? Like, we could probably ride around on one, actually. Okay, we're looking for a race -a something. You're shardy. <laughs> can you not tell me about race mm. uh, no, you look like trouble to me. What? Deldrin doesn't look like trouble. He's a good man. He's very good. Wholesome. Are you Raysa? You're Raysa. Hello. I'm Raysa Puglia, champion of the Legion garrison here at Buckmoth Legion Fort. And you're Teldrin Ebonheart. Caius Casares sent you, didn't he? Caius said you're the one to handle this sixth house base near Narmok. Only one trooper returned. He died soon after, horribly disfigured with corporous disease and out of his wits. In his ravings, he spoke of a cavern on the coast. He called it Il Ilanibi. <laughs> That's a weird word. It's not on our maps. Try asking locals in Narmot. They fought with cultists and disfigured man beast. Corpus monsters, I think. They fled the attackers and got lost in the caves. Then they ran into a half man creature named Dagoth Gares. This Dagoth Gares slew the rest of the patrol, but spared the one trooper. He told the trooper he was being spared so he might tell others that the sleeper awakes and the sixth house has risen and Dagoth Ur is lord and I am his priest and all will be one with him in the flesh. The trooper awakened outside the caves and returned here. We couldn't recognize him and he didn't respond to questions, just kept rambling on like a madman until he died. I just like hit my knuckles. Hmm. All right, so we need to go to Narmok now. We can do that. Uh, I kind of want to sleep somewhere. I guess I can just like sleep outside because like that's what we're used to doing anyways. Poor little Teldrin. We'll have a house eventually. I think it's somewhere off over here. I've already forgotten. I think it's right there. I think. I wonder if this is one of them that you can take a silt strider to. I can't remember. Too brain dead. <laughs> but we'll try. I lost Aldrun. It's over there. I went the wrong way. What a surprise. Hello, kind sir. This is actually my special. good friend. I think I've already explained why in a previous episode. He doesn't. He takes us to Maragon. Sounds similar, but not the same. Dang it. That leads to Maragon. I don't think we want to go to Maragon. Okay, I was nice to myself since I was so tired and I googled 
like Narmok, and I'm pretty sure you can get there from a boat from Cool. So we're gonna travel to Cool and hopefully get there by a boat. Cause I I don't know how much walking I can handle, especially because I know there's gonna be fighting later on in this episode. So let's just do it the easy way. <laughs> Go to cool. Cool's down here. Let's see if we can find a little boat that'll take us somewhere. Sorry if you can't see, it is nighttime. And to be honest, I can hardly see. But here's a boat. Nobody's on it though. Cool. Great. <laughs> Get it? Cool. Oh. How funny and clever. <laughs> it might not even be pronounced that way. Who knows? Wait, isn't this how you get to Solstheim? I think this is how you get to Solstheim. Yeah, that's that's to go to Solstheim. What about you, lady? Travel. Narmok, thank you. Okay, good. Because I, I don't want to use all of our health potions up or break our armor or anything and use up all my energy. This is probably best. Hi, high elf. Can you tell me about... No. Oh, Illanubi. Yeah, there you can. You can only speak to a friend. Of course you can, but luckily enough, I think... I think it's up here. Or is it up up that way? Is it north or south? I feel like it's this way. I could be wrong. I'm probably wrong, because I can't remember anything right now, apparently. I know it's on this island. Is it around here? I feel like it's along the water. But I don't know. <laughs> no, that's a tree. Okay, maybe not. Thought I knew where it was. I might, I might still be onto it. That's a cliff racer. There's a little shack over there. What is that? Oh, is this it? Shurin Ball. No, not quite. I guess it's up north then. So I'm not seeing it down here. What's this over here? Please lead me to the right place, Snatches. Please. Mm. Oh! Oh, there's a door! <gasps> the Netches did it! Okay, okay. Oh, I'm scared. Oh, I should have saved before going in here. It's dark. Alright. Quick save. And let's get out some torches. Let's, let's take these torches. And let's equip some. Oh, I'm so scared, guys. I'm so scared. We're gonna walk. Because we need, we need our fatigue. Oh, that's a pretty waterfall. Hello. So I'll just go through here. It's so exceptionally dark. Like, darker than usual, I feel. I, I don't know, but maybe. <gasps> Someone call me an inwall. <gasps> They're way over there. Hello. Are you an archer, though? No, you look like you're charging at me. How about you come over here, then? Go away! We're not interested. Oh, you died so fast! Oh, I feel so powerful and mighty. He didn't really have anything good. But that's okay. We took care of him. Feeling a little more confident. Don't know if I should. Especially because I can hardly see, like, two feet in front of me. Which is never good. <gasps> Dead adventurer, do you have anything good? Oops. Imperial Chain Greaves. Our Greaves are way better. You know what? We're gonna wear a helmet for this. I don't usually wear helmets, but we're gonna do it this time. How are our pauldrons? About the same? Oh, they are the same? Good job, me. Steel, Chris. <gasps> That's better. Give it to me. Yay! Okay, ooh, so fancy. And yeah, we'll take those. I hate the helmet, but look at the curse. It looks so nice. Teldrin just looks like a nerd now with his helmet. And Cave's making spooky sounds. That's great. I guess we'll go off this way first. Is this a bad torch? It's high quality, it says. But I don't believe it. They're all high quality. But I don't believe it, because it's it's not very good. I, I can't see anything. <gasps> oh no. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no, oh no, what is that? What are you? What is that? Hello? Oh, you're not as scary as I thought you were. 
There's, there's worse, but still. Uh, we're going to quick save and then sleep in hopes that the Dark Brotherhood doesn't get us or that we can, yeah, this isn't solid ground. Uh, is this solid ground? Yes, <laughs> until healed, please. Okay, we're good, we're good. Re-equip that. F5 again. There's a door, okay. Marowak spine, oh, okay, we will go in. I'm frightened. Oh, scam. Okay, scared me. You're not that scared. Oh, that's scary though. What is that? What? What are you? Run towards it. Ooh, bone walker. Hello. You're not so bad. You're not so bad. Okay, it hit us once, but we're fine. We're fine, you guys. We we've, we've got this. Teldrin is powerful. Very strong. Oh oh. Ooh no. No, 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 this is why I didn't want to be here. Ugh, I hate these things so much. Please die. Ugh, please. Ugh, so gross. Okay. We're just gonna save again. A little freaked out now. I hate zombies. Oh, you have me. No, no, you don't. I, be I bet you don't. I don't know where you are, though. You have better eyesight than me. I'll give you that. Oh, hi. <laughs> you don't even have armor on, you're stupid. Silly little elf. You are dead now. Someone call me an Inwa. I'm gonna let them come to me. <laughs> like, I'm I'm happy by my little thing of light here, actually. Is this- are they twins? <laughs> Look at his face, he looks surprised. Yeah, I think they were twins. Well, now I feel guilty. Oh, let's just keep tiptoeing on. I swear this torch is like doing nothing for me. Another dead adventure. Hello. One gold. Ooh. <gasps> cool. Viper blade. Oh, it's a short blade. Oh, uh, it's not even that great. Speaking of which. <gasps> our spark sword's all fixed up. We could use that. It's just like, I'm never quite sure. I think with the enchantment it's better than our silver long sword. I think. I'm, I'm not the smartest, but you know. Yeah, other than that, and your lockpicks, not really seeing much, but okay. <laughs> Probably why you died, you had bad armor, you know. Blackened heart, okay. I guess we'll go through there. What did I just press? I just pressed something. Instead of F5, what did I do? What did I just do? Okay, we're just back at the dead adventure, that's kind of annoying. That just gave me a heart attack because it was like clearing data. Like, I'm sorry, please don't clear all my data. <laughs> I need that. Man, that scared me. Okay. Ha, huh, let's go back to that door. Man. Oh, my wounds are great. Somebody noticed us this time. Probably just another dreamer. Yeah, he's just a loser. Coming at us with no armor. Bad weapons, you know. No big deal. See, he's already gone. Let's actually quick save now instead of what- I'm pressing F9. I- I misread it as five. I'm a mess. I'm a mess. So F9 is your- your quick load in case you were curious. <laughs> Apparently. I just have discovered. Let's get our torch back on, please. I hate this stupid helmet on Teldrin. Hate helmets. I know they make more sense and that's why I'm wearing one right now, but all the guys after us again. Okay. <laughs> Let's kill him again. <sighs> and hopefully not press F9 this time. Okay. I there's the door. F5. Oh, I guess I'm just like not used to the angle I'm sitting at. That's what I blame this on. Ah, it's another creepy dude! Hello! Go away! Don't zap me! Oh, you're powerful. You are very mighty. I might lose this battle. Please hit him. Teldrin. 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 Well, this might take a minute. But we'll get it eventually. Maybe. I don't want to use all my, like, stuff on him, but I guess we should just go ahead and use our ring. We're gonna run to him, try not to let him get that first hit. 
Ooh, we almost got it anyways. Oh, we got it. That's okay. That's okay. Just don't panic. If I could just land a hit, maybe we should switch back to our sword? I don't know. I can't see now. No, we got it. We got it. Let's just go run and sleep. <laughs> Hopefully we can. Oh, I need to put back on my shield for these battles. I always forget. I don't even have my torch on. What am I doing? Let's see what else wants to kill us. <laughs> His head's in a rock. What an idiot. Ooh, that looks spooky. Just a scamp at top, though. We're, we're fine. Just a scamp. Teljin's getting stronger. I'm so proud of him. I mean, you'd think he'd already be pretty strong from being in the Imperial Guard, but you know. Not that Bethesda knew that. Okay. What's this? Soul's Rattle. Sounds great. Let's go in. <laughs> ah, hello. Glass boots. Sorry. Yes. Please don't crash. Okay. We're good. Oh, no. 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 Don't do this. Don't do that. I feel like it's a lot brighter in here, at least. He's hitting me. Like, how rude is that? He can't hit me. Well, obviously you can, but, you know, it's rude to. Okay, we did it. Let's... Let's sleep. I was expecting this to be a lot harder. Knock on wood. We haven't finished this place yet. I don't know how much longer we have to go. But we'll find Gares eventually. Ooh, no, no, no. Oh, he noticed me. Okay, I'm gonna let him turn this corner. He can come to me. Yeah. Anytime now. He's just standing there. Menacingly! Oh, okay. Well, that sucks. Uh. <laughs> just run! Run across. Great idea, right? Uh, I'm scared. Oh, a scamp! Maybe it was just the scamp that noticed us? Oh. Dreamers. Hello. Oh, that room looks real spooky over there. Mm, not not appreciating that. I think we found him. Lord's friendship. Lord Dagoth gives me these words to say to you, so you may give them thought. Once we were friends and brothers, Lord Nerevar, in peace and in war. Yet beneath Red Mountain, you struck me down as I guarded the treasure you bound me by oath to defend. But remembering our old friendship, I would forgive you. And raise you high in my service. Uh, nah, nah. My lord Dagoth bids you come to Red Mountain. Oh, for the friendship I'm sure we'll be there eventually. I share, know we will be. You would grant you counsel and power. Nah. If only you would pledge that friendship anew. I am not your lord Dagoth, yet I too would say to you. Where even is this guy? I don't know where he is. No. Uh, that's just telling us about the shrine. Forgive the rude welcome, but until you have declared for us, we must treat you as our enemy. Okay, that's just great. Lord Dagoth would far rather have you as a friend than as an enemy. Sorry, Dagon. Until you submit to him, um, six house servants will treat you. Let's ask him about the six house. The six house was not dead, but only sleeping. That's nice. Now it wakes from its long dream, and with its lord, Dagon, it comes okay. forth to free more in the foreign rulers. Yeah, and to sure. Pretenders. When the land is swept clean of false friends and greedy thieves, the children of Veloth will build a new or garden of plenty in this blighted wasteland. Alright, guy, well, I think it's time to kill you. Quick save. <laughs> Real quick, before the fight. Where's he at? Is he over here? Oh, he's back right there! No! Ah! 
Okay. We gotta hit. We gotta hit. Oh, maybe we can do this. Maybe we can do this. Oh my god. He's just slapping us like an idiot. Wait, wait. What am I doing? Put on your shield. Children. We, we might. We might, actually. I cannot believe. I thought this was gonna be Soul Senpai all over again, but like, this guy's a wimp. You elephant looking jerk. Look at his face. What an idiot. Even as my master wills, you shall come to him in his flesh and to both his flesh. We actually did it? I mean, we were just cursed, which is great, but you know. We actually did it? Really? I wasn't expecting it to be that easy. Thank you, Morrowind. It knew I was stressed out. I was really scared. Uh, this was gonna take me a million times, but like, well, that was it. Oh, spooky, spooky. I think, I think we're good now. I, I think I quick saved once, but I'm gonna do it again. I know there's some loot in here. <gasps> yes, glass boots. They're light, but like, look how much they're worth. Like 8,000 septums. Like, uh, yes, please. And Tanto, uh, common pants. Bone mold pauldron. No. Jump up. Let's see. Common belt, common pants, pauldrons. Common shirt. You know, we'll take the shirt because, oops, it probably looks better than the one we have underneath this. Our shirt underneath is pretty ugly, so we'll just drop that. Common amulet, common ring. No, I know there's something good in here. I feel like there is anyways. I feel like there is. Hold on. What's that? Silver staff, ocean of light. I mean, I, I guess, I guess we'll take that. Armor's hammer, slow falling. Yeah, we'll take the scroll. Oh, hello, take that. I know there's something pretty good in here. Was it just the boots I was thinking of? I don't want to leave here without making sure. Oh, <gasps> these are it. I knew there was something. I feel like I'm like sinking lower <laughs> and lower as I'm playing. These are the gauntlets or what I was looking for because I knew there were good gauntlets in here. All right, they're heavy too. Thanks, Randagolf. Oh, and they're worth so much. They fortify strength and agility. That's perfect. We are wearing them and taking off the stupid helmet. <laughs> oh, so magical. Okay. Ooh, yeah, our, our things are all hurt, aren't they? Because we have been cursed. Pretty scary. So I guess trying to think if I should go back to Caius or if I've been recording for long enough. No, I think we're gonna leave it here. We're gonna leave it on a cliffhanger. A cliffhanger. We're gonna leave it on a cliffhanger because Teldrin is cursed. Who knows what's wrong with him? Probably a lot of you, myself included, but if you don't, mystery time. I'll at least sit up for the outro, I guess. But yeah, I think I'm gonna go ahead and leave it here at this spooky little cavern. Leave a like if you enjoyed this episode. I hope you guys are looking forward to the next one. I don't know when it'll be, but I'm gonna try to get it out within the next week, but I don't know if that's going to be possible, so it might be a couple weeks. We'll see what happens. I want to get ESO Morrowind out eventually too, but yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.